Yeah. New at 5 this time next week. Changes will go into effect for drivers in Oklahoma. Fox 23's Rick Marinano is reporting live for us with what to expect, Rick. Well, one of those changes would involve a car sale. If I were to sell you a car this week, this tag would go with you. Next week, the car goes with you and the tag stays with me. The rules of the road as you know them are about to change, at least when it comes to your tag and the paperwork in the glove box. You just carry it in your car like you do your insurance. Come next week, do you think you're going to get a rush? Yes, absolutely, <laughs> because just like you, most people do not have their registration still. Agent Jerry Marecki with the West Tulsa Tag Agency tells me she's surprised more people aren't preparing now for all drivers to carry their registration. Your vehicle registration is a piece of paper showing that you've paid for your license plate and that it matches up to your car. With the Oklahoma Tax Commission installing new computer software, at the same time people are rushing to be in compliance, long lines are almost guaranteed guaranteed starting next week. Once this kicks in, everybody's just mm -hmm. going to be confused. It's going to take probably at least a month for everybody to understand what's going on. And, you know, it, just like the last time we switched systems, it's going to be crazy for a while. Another change will come with the actual plate itself when you sell your car. You will now keep the tag with you when you sell your vehicle. And for five days, it will be okay for the buyer of your car to drive without a plate as long as they have a signed over title or notarized bill of sale. The new tag law, I I kind of like that because a lot of times people buy a car, the person they bought it from has done something illegal like buzz through a turnpike gate and they end up with a penalty on their tag. So this way it'll stay with the person instead of the car. Right now it's not clear who will give warnings and who will actually write tickets for these changes when it comes to what's in the glove box, but you need to be prepared to have license, insurance, and registration to hand over to an officer physically or show them on your phone uh, when it comes to complying with these new rules kicking in next week. We're live tonight in Midtown covering news that matters. I'm Rick Marin on Fox 23 News.